Hey everybody, so I hope you guys are having a fabulous, fabulous day. So today we're talking handbags. Now, I have never been someone who has to have a new handbag every year or even every season. I tend to stick with one bag, I buy one really quality bag and wear it for three to four years before I change a bag. Now that doesn't include evening bags, but just for daily wear, I usually try to find something that will go with most things and carry it because I don't have time to be schlepping back and forth, changing my bags, pulling everything out every day. I just don't have the time for that. So I've decided that since it's been four years since I bought my Louis Vuitton Eclipse bag, which I love and I will carry again, that's an investment piece, but I wanted something new. So I set out to find a new black stylish handbag. Well, I guess I've been living under a rock because when I went to my favorite mall here in Los Angeles, the South Coast Plaza, to check out some of the bags, the prices blew my mind. So I started off, I thought, well, I wanted to go into Louis Vuitton because I wanted to see what I could do to refurbish my existing bag. So I thought I'll be safe in there because they don't really carry mostly black handbags. Well, unfortunately, there I saw one that I fell in love with. Here it is. It is the Alma MM EPI electric bag. Look at this classic design. Now, I didn't even realize it, but this is really what I had in mind or what I was kind of wanting, something really elegant, really classy that would could go with so many things, go from day to evening if I wanted to even, when I wear a lot of black at night. So the sales lady, you know, got it down for me and then I was in love. I mean, it was the perfect size, I was the perfect weight, it had a lot of room in it. It was sleek, black, elegant. So I thought, okay, well, you know, this is probably no big deal. So she then proceeds to tell me how much it is. $2,010. I just watched the blood rush out of my husband's face <laughs> and mine. Of course, you're in there and you don't want to act like, like that's a big deal. Of course, I, I really think I audibly gulped. But anyway, I said, thank you very much. I'm just starting my shopping. Let me have your card and I'll think about it. Beautiful bag. Looks great. Well, Okay, so I walked out of there, licked my wounds, and proceeded on to another style that I like. I love Jimmy Choo, and I'd seen some magazines, some Jimmy Choo styles that I liked, so I went into Jimmy Choo. There again, there was another beautiful bag that I saw. This is the one. A really cute bag, lots of character. I, I really, really like this. Uh, stylish Blythe L bag in black with gold hardware. Now, Really, really cute. Loved it, actually. I thought it was very stylish. Had a lot of pockets inside and out. As you can see, it's a really, really stylish bag. And how much was this bag? $18.95. And no, I don't mean $18.95. $1,895. I gulped again. My husband leaves the store. <laughs> so... I'm like, okay, what what is going on? I mean, and, and by the way, the place is flooded. People are buying like crazy, and I'm thinking, wow, wow, this economy is either really, really picking up or everyone's pulling out the charge cards. I'm not really sure. But again, I left the store on a mission to find a bag that is less than that, that looks stylish. So on we go. So then I travel down to Michael Kors, and I really do like Michael Kors, and I found this bag. This is their Hamilton quilted tote in black patent leather. Now, I do like the style and look of this bag. It's fun with flair and uh, still stylish. Took a look at that price tag, $348. My husband goes, sold! I said, no, wait, I don't know, I don't know. I mean, I do like it. And a $348, and I mean $348, that's still a pricey bag for many, many, many people, including myself. So, but I couldn't stop thinking about that Louis Vuitton still in my mind. So I don't know what I'm going to do. I don't know what I'm going to do, but I haven't done it yet. I haven't bought anything yet. And if obviously if I were to choose a Louis Vuitton, I better start saving now. Maybe by the time it's out of style, I can get it. So that's the dilemma of the day. Handbags. What's your limitation? How much will you spend on a good handbag? I mean, that's the question of the day. I'd love to hear from you guys. Let me know. And hey, if you know of a great, fantastic, stylish black handbag, shoot it my way. I'd love to take a peek because I'm on a mission. So I'll see you guys soon. Have a fantastic day. And let me hear from you. I love it when you write. See you soon. <laughs>